morning, awesome people. Morning is a beautiful sign of hope created by our gracious Father to let us know that life doesn't end after the sunset. Every new morning is a new life, new hope, new joy, new grace, new faith, new strength, and new inspiration. This awesome morning, I want to capture my thoughts on remember the name Achilles versus Boagris. Achilles swing his sword backwards at 1.5 meters per second above the ground, piercing Boagris' shoulder at 2.0 meters per second. Given that the sword weighs 1.5 kg and it takes 1.2 seconds to change direction, what is the average force applied to the sword during this period? Hey guys, help us grow our channel by subscribing, sharing and hitting the notification bell for new inspiring videos. There's a memorable scene in the movie Troy. Achilles is roused from sleep to face the Trojans champions, Boagris, a massive warrior. The young messenger tells Achilles, The Thessalonian you're fighting, he's the biggest man I've ever seen. I wouldn't want to fight him. That's why no one will remember your name. How would we like to be remembered long after we are gone? What would they say was the most important thing for you? Will your legacy be based on your professional work, your career? What are your hobbies? What about your friendships, your generosity? Will your legacy about how you touch people's lives and positively impacted the world around you? King David was a musician, a writer, a poet and a warrior. David has been remembered as a young man who killed Goliath, the giant. David experienced many challenges throughout his life. Along his journey, he encountered a lion, a bear, a giant and other challenges. The way David chose to face his challenges was a key to his success and legacy as a leader. The confrontation with Goliath is a great example of David's courage in the face of adversity, a legacy that inspires others for generations to come. That is why we still remember his name today, facing our old giant and crushing them completely, our fears and challenges, taking action to improve ourselves and the lives of others around us, making the world a better place is a legacy worth remembering. Let us take a moment today to reflect on our legacy, the legacy that we are creating now and which will leave behind long after we are gone. Hey buddy, let this words kindle your spirit today. Dear Heavenly Father, give me the courage in the face of adversity and help me lean into you in all I do, for it is only with your grace can I leave a legacy, a legacy worth remembering, a legacy that inspires from generation to generation. The Lord blessed you, the Lord caused his awesomely inspiring presence to envelop you. And now now may the son of man who pass through the clouds on to the ancient of days, may the one who plays stars in space and makes snowflakes like soft span lace, may the one who drives the sun to bed and gives us the grace to always inspire to aspire higher before we aspire. Have a glorious week. Remember my name, Gideon Foley.